But I used to tell Fred all the time that he was my spiritual father because he is the one that really changed my life. Oh, when I went to that house meeting, like he changed Caesar's life when Caesar went to that house meeting. And I want to say to all of Fred's family that is here, uh, we know that we took your dad away from you. We took your dad away from you because he, we were so demanding of his time uh, in having him go out there and train the organizers for the union, uh, the organizers for different political campaigns that, and I know that your mom, Francis, I know she put a hard time, you know, she had with that, there was a time, I, I don't think the story has been told by anybody, but I remember once hearing, not from Fred or from Francis, but somebody in LA was telling me, but one time she was really, really sick, that uh, Francis was very, very sick, and yet Fred didn't stop organizing, you know, he, he used that to try to take care of her, but he was still organizing. And I, I don't know, I think that that commitment that Fred had that was so deep that he this and I call it the faith that he had in people. Because it's all of you know out there, when you go out there and you start organizing, you don't know who you're gonna get, right? You go out there and you have to operate totally on faith. And you could always know that somebody out there, somebody out there is going to be wanting to make a better world for people. And our job as organizers is to go out there and find those people. Find them, get them turned on, get them to make that commitment uh, to do the type of work that needs to be done.